All right, let's talk to Jacques. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Or pilot you look guy. Like the type. What if I said I knew where you could load up on military hardware? You mean that guy smuggler across the street? Definitely. Already know him, huh? It's too bad. Hey, how about I tell you about something you can't hear from anybody else? What's that? Area 51. You heard of it, right? Actually, I'd rather hear whether you know anything about a warehouse with an illicit generator. I worked out there. Most yeah, he still insists on telling us. Planet, but I didn't see any flying saucers. You want to hear about it? I'll tell you. For the price of a beer. Here's a beer. What do you have? That buddy? I just bought. If you can have this beer. That one's warm. Oh, you Give me something from the bartender. You sucker. I'm not letting that beer go to waste, though. <laughs> We're drunk. Yes. What'll it be? A beer. Another one. There you go. Thank you, Mr. Ungrateful down there. What do you have for him? Here. You can have this beer. I appreciate it. Yep, I know for a fact it's not just for government research. I've seen all kinds of executives coming and going. Coming and going. Bureaucrats fly out there. Billionaires. This guy's gonna be a while. I think the whole place has been taken over by a private corporation. Not likely. Something is going on underground. I'm a pilot, which means I didn't get any access to the main complex. But a lot of rock comes out of there. It's some kind of mine. But what I don't understand is why they're always laying more fiber optic cables. A pilot? What do you fly? Copters. You know what I think? I think that's where the UN moved Echelon 4 back when they promised hmm. they were going to stop spying on people. Maybe, maybe. Surveillance is a very distributed technology. To centralize it in one large facility would be very unusual, even for the UN. I bet they did it. They want to centralize everything. Every computer on the planet. Maybe. Maybe. Got anything else? Know anything that's worth the price of a beer? Ah, this old bird's had enough. Well, I'm about to go on duty. About to go on duty after what drinking that much. <laughs> You're with your Natco, right? Why do you ask? I'm the one that flies your brother Paul to Hong Kong. He told me to watch out for you. I didn't know you Natco hired pilots. The Black Choppers are run by the NSA. The Black Choppers. Various classified <laughs> operations. The Pentagon uses them. The CIA. They hired me because I don't ask. Everybody them. uses them. <laughs> what was Paul's assignment in Hong Kong? Like I said, I know how to keep a secret. Yeah. Even between brothers. Sure you do. So you just told us about Air 51. The reason you not co-transferred him back to the States. Listen to your brother, JC. Respect his experience. Let's leave it at that. All right. Your brother's one of the bravest men I know. Okay. Well, we're done here. But first, we're gonna take us some money. Oh no! I didn't have to. S uh, oh well. I didn't have to hack. Sixty-two credits. 36 credits. Eh. Alright, let's get some stuff done here. We had a lot of conversation. Not enough action. Uh, we're gonna change that now. Hopefully. Alright, we're done in the town. Let's go talk to Smuggler now. Never should have transferred. I just have to remember where he is on the PS2 version. I always forget. I always forget. I don't know why. That way it's blocked. The free clinic is that way. 
just went to the alley. I guess it's through here. Another loading screen. Broken down into chunks compared to the PC version. Which looked a little weird to me when I first saw it because I was used to this version. This was the one I played first. Thank God they ported this to the PS2, otherwise I wouldn't have been able to experience this game. Oh fuck, God. Alright. Damn. Alright, come on. What you get for not answering first? Give me a chance first. I could have been a friendly guy. To you. This is where a smuggler is. Alrighty then. Yes. Password. Bloodshot. Bloodshot. Thank you. Okay. So let's go on down, shall we? And we have our third loading screen. To smugglers. Our files show that the smugglers whacked out paranoid. Watch for booby traps. With good reason. The latest news, your brother's team hit some resistance. So they're gonna be delayed while we bring in chopper support. There was an alternate way to get in here. Uh, if we did not know the password. So, uh, We're gonna just make a run for it. And go. Don't give a shit. Thank you. Hello, smuggler. What do you want? Why the booby traps? <laughs> Afraid of something? Just precautions? Against what? Government's been having some kind of smuggler is Cisco. <laughs> so I know they've been disappearing. Blonde hair. Is that so? I think it's a big joke. Lift up a grate in the street. They got my friend for Go ahead and break down seeing the thong the song, smuggler. A lab. And the sewers? Maybe he was taken hostage by the NSF. These guys are pros. Definitely government funded. Interesting. Maybe I'll take a look. But I think you should have a little more regard for the United States government. If you're serious about going down there and finding Ford, I'll give you a deal on some hardware. Also, you'll need this. It's the key that can open the sewer manholes. Tell me about the hardware. I have a scope that will fit most handguns and rifles for 2,200 credits, a bioelectric cell for 800, and some light amplification goggles for 3,500. Uh. No, maybe I'll locate your friend. Expensive. Maybe I'll try to locate your friend. What does he have around here? Candy? Uh, and prior charger. On the PC version, this was glass. Medkit and a thermoptic camo. Don't need that password. 
Don't need no stinking password. Alright. That's done. I don't want to hurt myself, so I will take the long walk down. Now, hopefully that robot has desisted. It's done. I'm friendly now, robot. Get out of here. And I will meet you guys back at our bro's apartment.